like when you put everybody together and we're all doing something together, it just, it blows my mind how many people we can reach. Um, I guess it's just working with this great group of kids and watching them grow through Christ. It's fun. And why is it fun? Because I need to get out of class early. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is awesome. You do a good job, Noah. Thank we you. appreciate it. I know I do. And so the, the idea is that we need to stand strong even under great pressure and persecution. And you have it a lot easier in America. So you cannot now go to sleep, you know, uh, because it's easy. Because if you go to sleep about serving God and allowing other people to influence you and the bad movies and the bad people to influence you, then you are going to become a very weak person and you're not going to be able to stand strong. He said, you know what? When you raise your hands up, he said, you look kind of dumb. He said, but that's an expression, a reaction to God. He said, you can't look cool and think about yourself standing in front of the Lord going like this. And he said, and you know what else? Because we're God's children, he said, it's like a little baby saying, pick me up, Daddy. I want to be with you. They'll never be the same after this year because of what Jesus is doing in their lives. Well, Isaac's really uh, bring the gentleness to the chapel team, the way he interacts with the kids. He's always calm and patient with them. I like the fact that we have a drama team leader where a parent volunteer, she's helping direct the kids so there's not chaos on the stage. It's just a, it's a really neat experience to watch. Usually in, during worship the sounds are really loud and the, and the music is very loud and it's good, it's good. But sometimes something happens and the sound is down and all you can hear is the children singing. And they're all singing and they're all loving Jesus. And it's just like, I'm going, this is why I'm here, you know, to see the children change for Jesus. our verse was John 14 6 and Jesus says I am the way the truth and the life no one comes to the Father but by me and what that means is if you want to get to God and someday you're gonna to have to get to God because God created everything and he's in charge of everything and if you're ever gonna to get to God and God's the one that has everything that's good anything that you would want in life he has it and the only way you're gonna to get to God is through Jesus we get to do really, really, really funny skits, and and um, we get a praise and we get to do praise and worship, and we get to tell we get to tell people about God, and it's just great doing it. And if somebody comes along and says, um, "You're a Christian," you're not gonna sit there and go, "You don't like me because I'm a Christian." Yeah. You gotta sit there and go, "Yeah, I am. Aren't you? Why aren't you?" We do all these things to reach people, to bring them into the church, to, to bring them into the school, to, you know, to, to, we have all the games, we have the lighting, we have the videos, we have all the creative stuff, the dramas, the praise, we have all these things that are very, very appealing at first, and then they come in, and then we don't train anybody. We don't teach them how to get closer to God. It's just, you come, you get entertained, and then you leave. Well, that's not what chapel is about. We have all the lighting, we have all the things, uh, that are all there, all, all the appealing visual uh, elements, all the, all the dramas, we have all that stuff. But one thing I've shared with the kids is that you can have all, the, all those things, but if you're not focused on God during those things, then it doesn't mean anything. Because the most important thing that you can do with your life is follow God. Okay, Noah. Do I look okay? It looks beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. You know, I enjoy chapel because I love kids. As a matter of fact, I love America. 
Would I lie to you? Okay. And is that uh, is that <laughs> does that sum up your entire? Uh... I, you know, <laughs> I, I don't know how. To, I, I don't know. Okay, we're gonna have to start over. <laughs> and and Isaac, he's crazy. They know exactly what to be doing. How to in, have how to have the. Uh, they would say. Hey, nope. hey, I am filming right now. Go away. Turn to the person beside you and say, give me $500. Oh, I'm not feeling the love over here, so I'm going to turn around and I'm going to start preaching to myself. Glory, hallelujah, Brother Ivan. That was awesome. That was a blessing. 